You rightly said that there is a, a, there is a very unique partnership between India and Israel. And I'm happy that I'm here today. We can, uh, this evening, tomorrow, we can all celebrate 28 years of uh, official partner, of official bilateral relations between Israel and Israel that were, that occurred 29th of January, 1992. Um, I'll, I'll mention two things in this respect. Yes, there is a lot of similarities. Both India and Israel had been facing in, inter, in the multinational arena similar issues of, of pointing at us, at both our nation, and blaming us for different things. There is a lot of things that we can compare and a lot of things that are different. And I, and I rather don't do the equation because it's, it's like it's, it's, we need sessions of, session of history in, in order to do that. But I'll tell you, I tell you uh, in this respect uh, two things. First of all, our partnership is bipartisan. It, it's not only one party or the other. There had been, if, if you look at the different, you can, you can always see relationship in pictures, pictures of leaders. And I think that we all remember the picture of your Prime Minister, uh, 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 Prime Minister Modi, when he went to Israel and brought our Prime Minister, went in barefoot in the sea and in the Mediterranean Sea. They went there because, uh, and because of the partnership on water. And you saw this jeep of desalination go to China next time, there is an Israeli company that is, has two, one desalination uh, 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 plant and one wastewater plant in, in uh, Chennai. So this is, but it's <coughs> not just a, a partner, it's bipartisan and, and we have pictures the same of our right wing and left wing uh, mm -hmm. leaders, the same where as here. And this part, you're right that it's much more visible and accessible now. You can see more in the news, India and Israel together, but it is a long standing even before the 28, like 20 years ago, 28 years ago when we, when we launched. Now, when it comes to this article specifically and to similar incidents, because you know that Israel, we have issues with the UN because we have, it's very, it's very hard for us to have voting and a lot of friends in the multilateral arena for, all the reasons that I know that you all are aware of. Uh, India and Israel are partnering and, and, and backing one another in those kind of circumstances, and mainly like in counterterrorism, a, a different uh, resolution that are been, have been uh, uh, mentioned. You always do it, there is always a wise way to do it in, when you're conducting negotiation and you are building partnership. Uh, India had a unique role of being a kind of a, a, the time of a, of a, of narrow and the time of be belonging to non-aligned, non-alignment. And since then, there's a lot of changes. And your role and the role of India as a, as a important player in the international arena is getting, getting stronger and stronger. And we see India supporting Israel in different resolutions that are crucial to the security of the state of Israel. And our prime minister, is calling his uh, uh, counterpart and thanking him. And this partnership is the same going to be in, in, in similar cases like what you're mentioning now. It's always will be, there is always, it's always, a, a, there are many variants to every decision and every, and you have many stakeholders back home when you're taking, a, in the same way an Indian leader will, will see, are we supporting Israel in this case? Will we have other states that we want to be partners with? We all know that Iran for us is a total threat. Iran calls for the, the, uh, the um, alienation of the state of Israel. While India and Iran has a very unique partnership and we know that you have your national interest and we will not, we know that there are things that you will not support us, but that's good friends. We know we, when we can unite forces and we know when we understand that we have different agendas and different interests and we will do everything not to harm one another, but there will be times that we respect that will beg to differ. And that's okay, and, and, and you will see, and you've see, I think that if you look just at the UN resolution in the last couple of years, you see an amazing a change, and. And you, when you look at the future, I think that we will see much more changes.